sort of having this starter team, make it a beast team. We'd obviously get yourself on the description below, get yourself to use 7 buy, get yourself some cheap, reliable coins, and don't forget to use King with a cheeky 5% off. Right, let's get into the video. Yo guys, what's going on? King Flipper here and welcome to another Winter Wildcard SBC video. Today we have the 84 times 5 upgrade. Oh, EA have done dirty on this. I'm just all I'm saying. So it's out for two days. So Tuesday. All I'm going to say is the price difference between this SPC now and the second time you can do this is going to be unbelievable because of what you do. Uh, 584 untradeable. Uh, you can do it today and you can do it tomorrow from 6 p.m. when Team of the Weeks do come back out. You'll understand why. You need a team of the week, S you need a team of the week in this SBC. Yes, uh, you're looking at 28k. Three quarters of this SBC is a team of the week card. Mm. If you have untradeable ones, you're laughing. If you have tradable ones, you're laughing. <laughs> That's all I'm saying. Um, yeah, untradable ones, a hundred million percent do this SBC. Tradable team of the weeks you have, sell them. It's not worth the value of this SBC at all. Um, just wait until tomorrow when Team of the Weeks come back in packs. They're definitely going to come back down because people are going to start packing them again. Uh, so just bear that in mind. This SBC is very expensive. Again, I try and help you guys out. Obviously, I still do you a method, but I still try and help you guys out with the information that I'm trying to provide. It's not worth it. At all, not at the moment, not with the price of SB, not with the price of Team of the Weeks at 28k at the moment. This SBC has only been out for 45 minutes. Imagine what it's going to be out in a little bit once people keep buying them and buying and buying them. It'll they'll be over 30k probably in the next couple of hours. So just bear that in mind. 86 rates are the best to go for, even though 87s are literally only a couple of k more. That's how bad that is. Um, you need four eighty. You need three eighty-four rated players or higher overall. One of them's a team of the week, of course, uh, and then two up more eighty-fours. They've gone up a little bit, not loads. Uh, team of eighty-three, of course, we're smacked by eighty-three. You can't lower anyone else, as I normally do. Eleven players in squad. So we have an eighty-six rated team of the week card. Uh, it's two eighty-fours because you need three of them guaranteed anyhow. Uh, four eighty-twos and four eighty-ones. The good thing, eighty-twos and eighty-ones are cheap. This card, unfortunately, is not. Hoffman's one of the cheapest 86 rate team of the week cards. I said the 28k. Anything below that, even 75 rate team of the week cards, are 28k. Uh, so, yeah, not worth it at all. Um, Jekko and Munain, or Munain, or whatever pronounce his name as, uh, 3.4k at the moment are the cheapest 84 rate cards. Uh, Numrez, uh, Numrez Golds 82 and 81s are cheaper, so you've got Little Arms, uh, Jimenez, Alistondo, and Willy. Uh, 750 coins, buy it now. Uh, then obviously 500 coins at the moment, buy it now for your Numrez Gold 81. So you got Suchek, Matinho, Hebriel, and Adan. Uh, so yeah, this is nearly 40k. It will be over 40k because people are going to absolutely keep buying Team of the Weeks. Um, yeah, um, 40k for this SBC. <laughs> Next joke, please. Um, this is untradeable. Just remember, you need at least 186 and 485s to make your money back. And that is breaking even. That isn't even making low. That's breaking even. To make 40k. 86s are 11k and your 85s are 7. So even if you pull two 87s in this and then the rest are 84s, you're still not making your money back. <laughs> not worth it. 1 million percent not worth it, unfortunately, guys. But again, once it's repeatable, because obviously Tim of the Weeks are back, if Tim of the Weeks come back down to even, even 20k... Then there, it's a little bit more reasonable. But again, 28k. Yeah, they should be coming. I'd say they come. Actually, low rated ones will probably come back down to mid price once people start packing them. The higher rated ones will be a little bit more expensive, but you should be able to pick up a team in a week for. Especially, don't forget, it's out for a full day. So you can, you can get away with up to Thursday before 6 p.m. to do it. So you should. People should pack team of the weeks. Um. Again, if you have an untradeable team of the week, 100% do it. 100%. Most of you will probably have 81s. It's actually cheaper to do the team of the week upgrade, by the way, guys. Don't forget about that. Team of the week upgrade. Do that if you have to. It's cheaper than actually buying an 86 rated team. I don't know. I don't know what. I don't know. 
yeah, it's actually so like I'll actually show you like it's still there. It's available for a day. It's got one day left on it still. Uh, where are you? There you are. Ten times, ten times, ten times, ten times, and there you go. I, I, it's still there because obviously I remember doing it. 384s, don't forget they're 3.4k, 82 and 83, 82s and some 81s. Uh, 369, 10. You're looking at 14, 15k max, and it gives you a guaranteed 81. Please, for the love of God, guys, if you really want to do this, do this SBC. Please do not buy a tradable team of the week card. It's much cheaper to do it this way, please. But there we go. Hopefully this helped out. Uh, if it did, feel free to drop the thumbs up. It does help the channel and the video. Obviously, if you're new and you want to see more SBC videos like this, don't forget to hit that subscribe button. Make sure you got that notification bell on so you can keep up to date as soon as I upload these. Other than that, thank you very much for watching. I'll see you guys in the next video stream. Take it easy, obviously. Peace.